That's good. Already a little bug there. Maybe we made it past the intro. Shit. Charles the Fourth, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He liked orgies. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, which did little to endear him to the Pope. Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. People used to have really stupid names. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. Alrighty. Well... Guess I'm gonna go with the new game, considering I don't uh, have any games yet. Oh, and yes, I'm some guy from the internet. This is an introduction. Kingdom Come Deliverance. It's the hot new game that I'm, uh, what, almost a month behind on getting into? But I heard just so many things about bugs and people losing progress to the shitty save system and. It just, I uh, hear it's a, an amazing game otherwise. So I waited for a couple, you know, bug fixes and stuff to come out before I got into it. Just to save myself the frustration. So hopefully, here with version 1, decimal 2, decimal 5, it is uh, not as bug ridden as release. Yeah, um, get into it. War horse. War horse source. Sword horse. Oh, yeah, I kinda got that from the intro video. But it's cool. I'll read the rehashing of it. There's some trees, though.
God bless. Same to you. Today's a scorch. <laughs> I was gonna say about uh, how all the people, except for this guy, well, seem to be husband, lacking beards. how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. I was thinking, uh, shouldn't all the peasants have beards and stuff because they can't afford to shave? But I just remember the whole uh, Christian reform thing. They came with Henry. the whole grooming standards. Get up and now. You're ungodly There's if you have facial hair and shit. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slugger bed. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, that's nothing. Tell me about fighting in my tutorial. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. I don't worry, it wasn't that. Blacksmith that hates swords? I, I just scratched Makes myself sense. is all. Hmm. Kind well, of his livelihood. Just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. Yay! Started a quest. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Speech. Mm, nothing much. Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and, um... Well, I, uh, I lost track of time. Well, I hope he didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious-looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. I can double up on the speech, huh? You think he's teaching me sword fighting, don't you? What use would that be to me? Here. I'm not lying to you, Matt. All right, then, if you say so. I don't mean to pry, but you know your father takes a dim view of such things. Did I fuck up? I didn't get a second uh, level up there. Did I need to pick something else to get more levels? Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Matthew and Fritz aren't drunkards. I never said they were, did I? And if I really minded you going for a beer with them, I'd have put a stop to it long ago. I was young once, too, you know. And your father was no angel when he was in Kuttenberg. Of course he wasn't. <laughs> you don't believe me? Ask him yourself. All right, I will. Okay, so You're not a boy anymore, right, Henry. You're a man, all. and it's time to start acting like one. Yesterday, you promised your father you'd help at the forge. If you made yourself useful now and then, I wouldn't mind your mischief-making so much. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Is father angry with me for sleeping late? He's not happy. 
Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Oh, cool. I did get a second hey, level in it. <laughs> I was worried out. there. That's fucked up. How to apologize. Pick up all the things. These are now the game's based on realism, but be a little quicker. Ah, watch where you're going. Pick up some apple. I just wasted apples doing that. Yeah. Turned blue when I did that. Pick the site. Why would it be stealing? Don't I live here? I need to pick a lock in my own house. I guess stealing from your parents. Yeah, in here. That's Merb. Pops. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? All right. 
right. stains on your clothes. Nice. Eat. Sorry, I had to go and deal with something. Oh, probably should. Well, it's no great tragedy. Look at the stats the way it anyway, just told me to. Anyway, a lot of work to do today. Kind of pick I'm the finishing first a sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? Not drunkard? Heh, <laughs> that'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasso. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. I'm so good at doing close. Alright. Thick of milk. I want a bread. A loaf of butter. I'm not use any of the blacksmithery stuff right now, or at all ever. Hopefully, I can eventually. Son of a blacksmith! I better be able to do some blacksmithing. Still on my fetch quest. Yeah. Try to hey. Try to rake me. What the hell are you doing? Beat you up. Alright, I like that my quest includes secret objective that I wasn't told to do. Oh, good. I know, uh, there's stealing in the game, I assume the king won't get his silver. Can you not see I'm busy with Master Fafer here? If it's charcoal you want, lad, go and talk to my helper. Welcome, Master Tobias. First.
Knock knock, motherfucker. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off. Booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. If I had anything to give, I'd give it. But I've got nothing. So leave me in peace, all of you. Jesus, look where you're going. chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. At least eat his food. Quite a lot. That's everything. Here's your change. I'm always glad to serve you. Change and thank you. Come again anytime. Buy anything. Yeah. The Lord be praised forever. Achoo! Woo! Ah, man, sneeze so hard it hurt. You can't be serious, Dutch. In insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to? He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Gutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts? Traitors. Now, even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsches spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the Empire! <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the Popes. Which is the rightful Pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. 
Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? Too I Matthew. you. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, doing some turns will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. Don't necessarily so, want to touch shit. Uh, are you with us? Peer pressure, man. Peer pressure. I didn't want to touch the horse shit. No. What's this? I don't give a shit. Alright, I'll do it. But then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem. We'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done plastering Deutsch's house. I'll be happy to sort out that drunken oaf. Alright, let's go while Deutsch is still sitting safely in the tavern. What a shitty quest. Huh? Huh? From the so intro, it seemed so like not. that Dutch Wait. guy. Deutsch. We have to check that the coast is clear. Right. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. I'd rather take that job than the shit shoveling. What do you want, lad? A little alone time? I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exceptions, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start, what about the Popes? He might have mentioned the Popes, too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. <laughs> Alright, I did my part. You guys handle the shit. See ya. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! This is all good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. 
Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund. Woohoo! Eat shit, Doshus. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse hunt! Let's make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! Alright, time for a combat tutorial, it looks like. Gone weak at the knees, have you? Uh, 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 Maybe we'll get Take the scenic route. Shit stained hands.
Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. Really? Finari Strait not good enough for you anymore? It's just that someone has something that doesn't belong to him, and I want to take it back. <laughs> if you say so. It's not skin off my nose anyway. I've got some lock picks you can have. But if you get caught, you can get them from me. <laughs> Never heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> I'm either hope not intimidating the guy. I'm robbing him. Close the window so no one sees me. Apparently did not understand that. Look at this. Oh, seriously? Hmm. A locked chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. I didn't figure out what the fuck I was doing until I broke the last one. Wait, you'll give me more. Training, right? How did things end up at the Deutsches? His whole house is covered in shit. True, but I'm worried that fucker ha Well, let him. Good point. It's I need a hand with Kunesh. Sure, me. You helped us, so we'll help you. Let's get to it then. Hey! Jesus. Look. <sighs> A bit more. What the hell are you doing? Get out here, you old goat. I've something to show you. What is it? 
What the fuck are you here for? You want me to take a whip to you or call a catch pole? Just try it, you old drunk. Watch it. I'll remember you. Enough! Enough! I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? You serious? What? What the hell are you doing? <sighs> Damn. How are you? I need to get my quest from here. And charcoal. Are you serious? Hey, Pip, do you want to learn something? No, I don't think so. Thanks. Suit yourself. Hail to the hero. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? No, it was nothing. Except Mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. froze up for a second and I was going to experience my first crash. I hear that's a problem. Wait for him to walk over there. Make haste, buddy. Are you sick? Get stuck on a rock now.
Indeed. Looks like an arena. Aptly named. So, can we get started? We can. Good. And since today is the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Not bad. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Good. What's again? enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. Are you serious? I am serious. I am serious XM Satellite Radio. for flirting and beer. Time for finding the door. God save, my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my Hair beauty, just broke. what else might your worship desire? The Deutsch is mouthing off again. Oh, and talk to me about him. He's a good customer, but when it comes to politics, he's unbearable. The number of times I had to throw him and the others out so they wouldn't start brawling. Well, I'd say he's an exceptional forum today. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Don't worry, Would dearest. Do? This evening I'll see you right. Oh, how? I do hope so. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. 
<laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyan? I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Good health to you, Henry. Alright. Save you, get drunk. Makes sense. God save. There is no God. So I'm assuming that guy isn't a bandit like she just said. I'm assuming he's the super important guy. In like disguise or whatever. He's in a fake name so people don't uh, give a shit about him. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? I've just been to the tavern. The Deutsch was saying all kinds of shit about how Sigismund should be king. That bastard. One day you'll get his teeth knocked down his <laughs> throat if he doesn't shut up. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the crossguard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? The ah, shut up and for give one me thing. what I want or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent! Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. What did you actually do in Kuttenberg? Oh, all sorts. You had to be able to put your hand to anything if you wanted to make a living. But I was never far from iron. I'd like to see Kuttenberg sometime. I'll take you there one day, never fear. It's a beautiful city. But in the end, you'll learn the best places here by the Sasso. We've kind nobles, fertile land, and plenty of everything. And do you know Sir Radzig well? We've known each other long enough. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master in Sassau did for us. Look at that lad. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damned if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have you got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. I'm not sure. Really? 
because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the King. He got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Good. And we'll never have this conversation again. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? The boy gets caught making a fool of himself, and he still hasn't learned his lesson. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and what? You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. Right, suck that dick. Don't jerk it off. Wait, did I interpret that right? Furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Do it. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles. Had a bridge made over the Moldau, and founded a university. And all, all without a war, he knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. Henry, are you all right? <laughs> Henry, what do you need, son?
too much fallout. I keep trying to hit R to uh, loot all. Here are those nails you wanted. Thanks. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering, will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. Can I ask, though? Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. <laughs> we did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a Let commoner? Then try it. You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. Hey, sir. Little finger looking ass motherfucker. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, Sir Isvan. Have a safe journey to Sasso. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Huh. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in scallets, here beneath the linden tree and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them or beat them? Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Until you do. A messenger. He was in a hurry. 
What's happened? Till the Fire Nation came. to the house and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry! What about you? Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No! You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Redzik. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. to the house it's making my mic fucking go off. Sorry about the noise. There's a plane just like right over my house right now. I hate when that happens. Hello, I'm primary antagonist. Skelet.
would think that there's a quest objective that should be flipped. How they find the horse before he arrives. What about picking? How am I supposed to do alchemy? Mogus to the left along the stream. Sorry, that I'm supposed to be getting it. Whoops. <laughs> 